It's good to see you again, brother. This time, though, I fear I carry some bad news for you. Yeah, well, I'm used to that by now. What's going on here? Kyle, you already knew, didn't you? People not getting infected, that it's just smoke and mirrors. It is the smoke, literally. Our mother found a way to fight the sickness using a certain, let's call it an elixir. You have seen it working with your own eyes. So you do have a cure? Would you call a bandage on an open wound a cure? No. What we have right now is just a temporary solution. We are working on a certain curative project, one with more permanence. But we need time, and we need peace to last for just a bit longer. Now let me guess, you're running out of this elixir. Unfortunately, yes. That's why I asked you to come here. I want to offer you a deal. Find us more of it, and a fair portion will be yours. A mother will teach you how to use it. You'll be able to return to Haran with your prize, or perhaps you'll choose to stay with us. It seems like you've got an idea of where to look for this stuff. A lot of our brothers were out searching for it, and recently we lost contact with three of them. They were supposed to check a certain cave. You're seeing the mist. Cannot be a coincidence. It must have been spillage. Seems that someone found the elixir and ran away with it. All right. So check out the cave. Got it. Farewell, brother. I hope the news you bring back is good. times better than Antizin. The good news? They'll share it with me. The bad news? I need to find it. Now, I know the clock's ticking, but I can't let go of this yet. It's the best chance for all of us. I understand, Kyle, but please, please hurry. I'm out of More reason for me to get this done. Keep your fingers crossed.
goods are undamaged. All right, then where are they? Mayday, mayday. This is very fire. We will to detour. The goods are undamaged. I say again, the goods are undamaged. Immediate assistance required. Holy fuck, Rises men? That's one of them. Okay, second one's dead too, no surprise there. Are you there? I'm at the cave you mentioned, and I found two of your brothers dead. I also heard a distress call. It mentioned some goods that aren't here. and be on the lookout for orange uniforms, or, or a symbol, three horizontal stripes. Excuse me? The bandits in here, these are Rise's thugs. They're worse than the undead. What happened in Haran? It's mostly their fault. Oh, I see. Thank you, Kyle. I'm sure that information will be useful. Zir, you there? The infected got into Ozan's place. He's dead. Is Eski there? Is she alright? No, there's no sign of her. There's another girl here, though, who didn't make it. I'll, I'll keep looking. Don't worry, Jazir.
There you are. And am I glad to see both of you alive. What are you doing here? How did you get through that hell? Well, I could ask you the same thing. What were you guys thinking? There were only a couple of biters wandering around when we got here. Yeah, but then some bandits showed up and started shooting. Next thing we knew, the place was flooded with undead. Oh yeah, well it's time to head back. Your dad's worried sick about you. Huh? We're not going back. Forget it, Kyle. This isn't a decision my father gets to make. Eski, Jesus, I, I knew you were strong-willed, but I didn't think you were crazy. We're going to Haran, Dara and me. We want our own lives. But listen to me, Haran is just as big a death trap as this place. I'm not going to live the rest of my life chained to my father's leg like a fucking dog. No, you can't- Kyle, please! I told you, I'd ask you for a favor someday. This is the day. I need you to help us. 
We know that it's dangerous in Haran, but this place is killing us. You just got here. Imagine living here. Imagine living among those people. How sick of it you'd get. There's a tunnel not far from here, a path into the city. That's where we're going. All right, all right, but I need to check that tunnel first. Now promise me you won't set foot out of this trailer till I tell you it's safe. We promise, Kyle. Thank you. Thank you so much.
Contact me once you're safe in the tunnel, okay? I won't tell your old man anything for a while in case you've changed your mind. We're not changing our minds. Yes, I'll call you.